going to go ahead and review how to register online for parks and recreation activities. You'll start out on the town's webpage, which is orevalleyaz.gov. From here, you'll go to Visitors at the top and click on Parks and Recreation. Once on the Parks and Recreation screen, you'll click on the green button on the right-hand side of the screen that says Register for Classes. If you are a new user, you'll click here next to Need an Account. On this screen, you'll enter in all of the information about your household. Notice that the red text is required data and the black text is not required. Start out by entering in a user ID, something you can remember for future logging in, and a password. Go ahead and type that password again. Enter in your first name and your last name. Select your gender and enter in your birth date. If you have secondary guardian information or spousal information, feel free to enter that in here. Otherwise, you'll need to put in an email address and type that again to confirm. Go ahead and put in a phone number and a mailing address. in your city, state, and zip. Go ahead and enter in emergency contact information at the bottom. And click finish. If you need to add additional family members, go ahead and click on add family member. The last name automatically generates for you. Go ahead and enter in the first name. You may change the last name if you need to. Select the gender and enter in the birth date. You can enter in school grade if you like. It is not required. Go ahead and click finish when you're done. If you need to add additional family members, you can go ahead and repeat that process. If your information here is complete, go ahead and click done. At this time, your information needs to be imported into the system by Parks and Recreation staff. If you're completing this process during business hours, Monday through Friday from 8 to 5 p.m., feel free to contact our office at 229-5050 to expedite the process. Otherwise, you'll receive an email letting you know that you've been imported into the system with your login and password, and then you'll be able to go ahead and go online and register for activities. Once you receive that email, you can go to Member Login and log into the system. Go ahead and click sign in once you've entered in username and password. If you'd like to look at all of the activities that Parks and Recreation offers currently, then you'll click on Browse Activities. Here you'll see a listing of all of the different classes offered. You'll see an explanation of the activity. You'll see the date range for that activity, the times, the days of the week, and the fee and the age. For additional information about activities, you can click on the item details button on the right hand side of the screen and more information will come up. To register for one of these activities, you'll click on the shopping cart picture on the left hand side of the screen and it'll say add to cart. A box will pop up from the bottom of your screen. In that box, you'll click Enroll Now. You'll then see a listing of members in your household, and you'll be able to select which member you'd like to sign up for this activity. Check the box of the appropriate person. You can fill out the survey about how you found out about this class if you'd like to, and then go ahead and click Add to Cart. You'll need to click the Agree button to the Hold Harmless Waiver. From here, you can add a note for staff. Once you've entered in your note, if you need to enter a note, then go ahead and click Save Changes. If 
you are done registering, you can go ahead and proceed to checkout. If you have more registering to do, you can click Continue Shopping. Once you hit Proceed to Checkout, it'll ask you what kind of credit card method you'd like to use. You'll select that credit card type. It'll fill in all of your information. You can go ahead and verify that that information is correct, and then go ahead and hit Continue. In this screen, you will enter in your credit card information and you'll select the month and the year of expiration and you'll click submit payment. This will generate a receipt in the system and will complete your registration process. If you have any questions concerning your registration, feel free to contact our office at 520-229-5050. And this completes our training session on registering for Parks and Recreation activities. Thank you.